So a while back I did a couple of tutorials on the composition process for jazz. In this video, we're going to take that composition, which I entitled Bayview Bossa. I live in Bayview Village. And we're going to talk about it in terms of comping and rhythm and changes, things like that. I'm going to play the tune first in its entirety. It's basically an AABA tune. And when we come back, I'm going to discuss it in detail. Let me play the song for you, chorus of solos, and then let's dive in. Let's get started.
right, I hope you enjoyed that. The first thing we're going to do is just talk about the form of the tune. So in this particular case, we've got an A section, which repeats, and then the bridge starts here, which we'll call B section, and then it comes back to the head here, which we'll call C. But it's basically an A-A-B-A -A structure tune. It's not 32 bars because the, the bridge is a little bit longer. And what I really wanted to talk about today in terms of the bossa nova is just sort of that airy feel. You'll notice that in the composition itself, I'm basically playing chords like this. So the rhythm would be like that. One, two, and three, four. And in terms of the chords themselves, what I'm doing is essentially these airy voicings. Now I know there's much richer voicings that we've talked about in the past, things like this for F minor nine, and then for D flat seven, sharp 11, which I kind of play from time to time, but when you're talking about a melody like this, very laid back, very dinner music in terms of jazz, dinner music. It is good idea to just play more airy voicing. So if I look at the F minor nine chord, what I might do in the left hand is something like this, where I'm playing G, A flat, and E flat here, and then just repeat that again. The key signature should be in here. I think it's in the key of A flat. Yeah, so just so I don't have to write in the accidentals. Okay, so then when I get to the D flat seven chord, I'm playing this. So from the F minor nine chord, and you'll notice it has the ninth in the root. And you really want to keep that going throughout the tune. If you get to the A flat major seven, again, I can point out some of these voicings for you where this chord is exactly the same as the F minor nine chord. So you can just repeat it. So instead of the ninth of the F minor chord in the root, it's the seventh of the chord. And it's essentially just the same chord. So. But of course the root changes, right? So of course, depending on what the bass player is doing, you want to keep those voicings as clean as possible. And then when you get to the A minor seven flat five chord, let's grab a new piece of music or a new manuscript. So when we get to the A, half diminished seventh or A minor seven flat five, it's this. So A, D, E flat, and G. And then the D seven flat nine chord is this, G flat, B flat, C, and F, like that. And then it goes, yeah, to G minor seven. So like this. So what I would suggest is that you play those voicings first, like. And then it goes to the next page. It's a 2-5 of F minor. So I hope you enjoy the tune. I'm going to 
post the sheet music below and also the backing track so that you can play along with it. Now the bass player is doing something like this. And while it's a bossa nova, it doesn't typically follow that bossa nova. But it does do that when you get to the bridge. So when you get to the bridge and it goes to B flat major seven, it's like. Okay, so that pattern in the bass I think it, from a compositional standpoint, needs to be heard, and that's why I'd like you to keep the voicings to a minimum, just these rootless left-hand voicings, and then, of course, the right hand is just playing the melody. So I hope you enjoy the tune. Again, I'm posting the sheet music below and the backing track. If you have any questions or comments about this, please post them in the comments below. And I'm gonna continue this tutorial in another video, keeping going with the bossa nova, and we're gonna talk a little more about soloing. So please join me for that video as well. Thanks for your time.